Hello and welcome to day three's tutorial and um, we're basically going to go over something basic but it's not too basic and it is very helpful for films out there nowadays and some people do not do this and they should because it's again very helpful and sets the attitude and mood for the film and that is color correcting. Now you can watch a video <coughs> for like an action thing but what really sets the mood is the acting and the color correction to me at least that appeals me like how good it looks and it can be simple as just raising the saturation but it does so much for your film so we're gonna go over that today um, later on in the week we're gonna go over muzzle flashes creating title animation and intros and after effects cloning where to get props and so much more <coughs> um, we're also planning on launching a second channel for all the other tutorials that we know about and that you guys want to request so it's going to be very interactive and very fun so we hope that you guys participate in that anyway I'm going to import some footage that we filmed it's very simple it's Jared walking out his house but it is very simple to the point where we can go over this so I'm going to loop region this real quick it takes a second and just in slow-mo you can kind of see that it is a basic shot of pan up and there he is walking by I'm gonna play this back sure. alright so you see it's kinda of basic just walking by the camera what I do normally is I go under color corrector normally secondary and studio RGB to computer RGB I always select that for the film because it darkens it saturates it a little bit creates a little better look and I'll show you the difference. Alright, so we got Sanchez right there. And if we just uncheck it, you can see it adds a great deal of color to the shot. Sony Vegas is a very basic program to do this in. There are some cool um, new blue effects for colors that I used to have. Some magic bullet stuff. And, you know, that's all good stuff, and it is very helpful. You get to use their presets and to create better presets for your own videos and stuff. Um, normally, I'd suggest doing stuff like this in After Effects because this is all post production visual effects, anyway. So, but if you're doing this in Sony Vegas because you therefore do not have After Effects, I'm going to show you some things you can do. Sony Vegas offers the color corrector wheel, and that helps a great deal because you can adjust the saturation, gamma, gain, and offset to basically make your video a little better. I can make him almost red. Now there's other things you can do. I normally use presets and gradient map. Magic bullet looks and new blue effects have some cool stuff for Sony Vegas presets and even for After Effects. I'll go over that when we do the After Effects part. So make sure to color correct your videos because it does just does look so much better. Look, look at this just from the color correction we did. Ten times better. So make sure to do that. Now let's go over it in After Effects. Alright, right now I'm in After Effects for the same basic tutorial. We'll shrink this just a little bit. Alright, they have a preset folder just for color correction. You click this and you have different sections. That just shows you how much. You can choose the tint the trit tone, the shadow slash highlight, the photo filter, levels, hue and saturation. There's so much that you could adjust here, even the exposure. Or you got something called presets that you can buy or find for free. Cough, cough. <clears throat> Under here I have a few. I got the Film Magic Pro, which is pretty great help. They got tons of presets. I can make my own using theirs. Okay. Now, Magic Bolt looks. They have a whole bunch of stuff for you. They got like a whole program for you to go about that kind of look. As you see, the Looks Builder window pops up. And you'll get the video, and you can choose what kind of feel you want from it. And, uh,. You know, let's just say Sunny Delight. See, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good, I must say. 
add a fill light if I want to with a, some kind of tone to it. Really great stuff for Magic Bullet looks from Red Giant, so definitely look into them. Description for links.